power will be installed on these lights here. They are a 10 pack off of Amazon for about $48. Alright, starting on the back, we use the bracket here. This is going to be on a plastic bumper, but I drilled a hole out to 5 16 right there. Put that one in. As you can tell, when driving down the road, it is completely up underneath the bumper. It cannot be seen, but it is down below to bright ride some light. Moving forward behind or in front of the rear wheel, I have undone the bolt on the rock rail. And added that straight in. As you can tell, it does sit just a little bit below, but it is kind of protected by that angle. Moving up to the driver's side right at the front here. Again, using the rock rail bolt, we just added that in. Again, it's kind of got that same slant, so that's the angle there. It does have some protection. And moving up into the front driver's side, both sides had this hole though. On this bracket here, there's a small hole. Just put it right through, tighten it down, and this provides that light down here at the side where it does have protection from that bumper. On these lights, this is the way the bracket tree work. This part here I've bolted up on the other side. And an easy way to install the nuts here so they don't come out is when you put it in, bring it up at an angle where it is sitting for the bolt to come in. like that and then by using a small piece of tape you're gonna basically just shove it down in here it's hard to do it with one hand just like doing that what that does is that is gonna keep that nut upright for when you go to put the bolt in through the side and as you can tell up here let me get the light that is the bracket that I've already screwed into that hole just having a problem focusing there we go. So as you can tell, this is with them on. Which we do have the auxiliary switches in here, which I've hooked it up to three, which is up in here. From here, when running back and across, there's a little plastic piece here, and if you look real close, these little tabs, all that you do is stick the screwdriver in right there and this whole entire front part will actually come down just like that all the way across and that's how I was able to run the wire across uh, from there I ran it basically through the frame and I've just got to finish actually putting some wire loom on this right here it's gonna be on the 2018 JL Wrangler for rock lights using a standard light that I'll click an image on here for in a moment.